Hey guys, welcome to another Server Miner plugin tutorial. I'm your host, LTGym007, and today we're looking at the Ultimate Rides plugin. Now, this is a fantastic plugin which allows you to make a lot of different things, including rides using minecarts, or you can build your own block and have it go around uh, a centerpiece. So this plugin is pretty complicated to use, but it has a lot of potential. You can do a lot with it, and if you take the time to learn how to use it, um, you can create some amazing things. So the ride over here is sort of a section of a teacup ride where the minecarts just go round in a circle. And over here we have a couple of um, builds, which it copies this build over here, and it goes spins around the point, and you can customize everything. So first of all, we are going to sort of recreate this using this weird car thing I've made over here. It's not very good, but it'll do for the tutorial. So first of all, let's go ahead and grab a block. So we need to select it similar to world edit. So we are going to go down here. We're going to do forward slash U ride and then structure. And we're going to create a new one. And if if this message comes up, we need to abort it and then do the create message again. Once we're here, we can select point one, which is going to be the bottom point, and then go to the other corner, build up a block um, like that, delete these, and then go on top of it and do point two. Once you've done that, you can go to the middle, which is going to be here, and this is going to be our origin point. There we go. And once you've done that, you can do the build command and that will create everything. So to make sure you've done it correctly, it should list all of the materials inside the structure here. So we've got lots of different types of wall and the metadata. That means we've done it correctly, which is good. So once we've done that, we want to sit on the top and create a new ride. So the way we do this is forward slash EU ride, ride create, and then the name, let's call it server miner, if we can spell it correctly. There we go. So once we've done this, it gets slightly complicated with elements and ch children. So if we do forward slash u ride element child and then add and then we're going to add a rotor and this rotor is going to have a radius of 8 and it's going to go clockwise to so put true. Once you've done that you can start adding um, your structure. So if we do forward slash u ride element child select and we're going to select 0 and if you do child list this will list all of your different um, children that you have but we don't have any at the moment so we are going to do element child add and then structure and the structure is id of two i believe there we go and it should pop on in front of you so you can add as many as you want we're going to add four there we go and once we've done that we should be able to ride it so if we do force you ride ride start and of start and it's called server miner there we go and it is working perfectly. So as you can see, here is the middle. We have the four different cars spinning around the centerpiece, like so, and it looks pretty great. Obviously we can use the same command to stop it if we want to, so stop, and then we can restart it again. Um, where's the command? There it is. So you could do so much with this plugin. You could have a nice um, centerpiece in the middle of your Minecraft spawn with things flying about and whatnot. Uh, to make it look nice but we could also add minecarts if we wanted to so create a new middle point and we're going to do u ride ride create and then mc it's going to be the name of it once we've done that we can create a rotor as we did before so element child add rotor the radius is going to be five and it's going to go anti-clockwise this time uh, once we've done that, let's select the child, so child select and then zero. Once we've done that, we can add an entity, so child add entity and it's going to be a minecart like that. And let's add maybe five, six of them or something. And we can go ahead and do four slash u ride, ride, start and then mc. And that will allow the minecarts to go round the centerpiece like that and we can actually hop on and have a ride around if we want to. The last thing I want to show you is how to create something like this where you have multiple minecarts spinning around uh, the same point. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that. First of all we need to create a point, uh, stand on the top of it and do forward slash u ride, ride create and this is going to be I don't know, test 2 for example. And Once we've done this we can create an element again. So 
elements, child, add, rotor, radius is going to be eight, and the clockwise is going to be false. Once we've done that, we need to select said child, which is going to be ID zero, select zero. Once we've done that, we can add some more rotors, but we are going to reduce the number to three, the radius to three, and clockwise is going to be true. So let's add two of these, for example, and then we're going to select ID one, and once we're here, we can add some minecarts. So one, two, three, four. Go ahead and select maybe ID two and add uh, some minecarts. One, two, three, four. And hopefully, if we do U ride, ride start, and then test two, uh, we should have four minecarts going around like this. There we go. So that's how that works. Um, and they're overlapping bit but you can have a play around with this as I said it's a pretty complicated plugin but as long as you put in the time you should be able to master it and create some really cool things so if you want to download the plugin the link will be in the description if you need a server to host it on check out serverminer.com for the best and cheapest hosting around and if you want to check me out I will be in the description down below so subscribe like comment and I'll see you next time